What happens when two Steelers legends, Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown, decide to reunite after years apart? Last Sunday, ahead of their matchup against the Las Vegas Raiders, Bell and Brown appeared together at the infamous Terrible Tailgate, rekindling memories of the unforgettable Killer Bee era. But is this reunion just a moment of nostalgia, or is there something bigger at play? And will we see Ben Roethlisberger join them for a full-fledged comeback? Let's explore this intriguing reunion and what it could mean for the future of the Pittsburgh Steelers. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to stay up to date with all the Steelers news. It was a reunion that took many by surprise. Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown, two names that were synonymous with Steelers' success and controversy, met at the terrible tailgate in Las Vegas before the Week 6 game. This was an emotional moment for fans who still remember the glories and hardships from the Killer Bee era, when Bell, Brown, and Ben Roethlisberger were part of one of the NFL's most feared offenses. Seeing Bell and Brown together after so many years and controversies brought a sense of nostalgia and hope. Both left Pittsburgh in turbulent situations with contract disputes, public disagreements, and a cloud of uncertainty over their careers. Yet here they were, smiling and ready to celebrate with Steeler Nation. While the reunion was a surprise, it raises a lot of questions about the future. Are these two stars moving on from past hurts? And more importantly, will this reunion pave the way for something bigger? Pittsburgh fans can't wait to see what happens next. With Brown already teasing a possible return to Pittsburgh, all eyes are now on what could happen in the coming weeks. And who knows? Maybe this is just the beginning of a new phase for these former players. There's no denying that the killer BS era was one of the most exciting in recent Steelers history. Between 2013 and 2017, the combination of Bell, Brown, and Roethlisberger was one of the most prolific trios in the NFL. Each week, fans eagerly awaited the plays of Bell, who revolutionized the running back position with his patience, and the unbelievable catches of Brown, who seemed to defy the laws of physics on the field. This was an era marked by big wins and an offense that scared any defense in the league. Under Roethlisberger's command, the trio managed to lead the Steelers to several playoff appearances and almost title wins, although the long-awaited seventh Super Bowl victory never came to fruition. However, despite all the success on the field, the killer BS era was also marked by turmoil contractual issues, behind-the-scenes disagreements, and eventually, the acrimonious departures of Bell and Brown put an untimely end to this golden period. What seemed like a budding dynasty was ultimately dismantled due to off-field factors. Now, with Bell and Brown back on the Steelers' radar, many fans are wondering, can we relive some of the magic of that era? And, more importantly, will we ever see Roethlisberger, Bell, and Brown together again? even if it's just off the field? Antonio Brown is known for his brilliant plays on the field and his controversial statements off it. During the terrible tailgate, he sent Pittsburgh fans into a tizzy by suggesting that he might be back in town for the Week 7 matchup against the New York Jets. While he didn't give any details on what that would mean, the mere mention of a return has generated a lot of anticipation. Brown's relationship with the Steelers was full of ups and downs. He was arguably one of the best wide receivers in franchise history, breaking records and becoming a global star. However, his tumultuous departure left scars on both fans and the organization. After disagreements with head coach Mike Tomlin and Roethlisberger, as well as several episodes of controversial behavior, his departure was seen as the end of an era. Now, with Brown indicating he may return, there is a mix of excitement and caution. Is he truly ready to reconnect with the organization and the fan base he once represented so proudly? Or is this just another episode of his unpredictable personality? The answer remains unclear. Regardless of what happens, one thing is clear. All eyes will be on Heinz Field next week, hoping that this symbolic return can bring new energy to the team. Le'Veon Bell was undoubtedly one of the most dynamic and innovative running backs of his era. His patience and vision made him a nightmare for opposing defenses. But, like Antonio Brown, his departure from the Steelers was marked by controversy. Bell decided to sit out the 2018 season due to a contract dispute, and his absence was deeply felt by the team. After his departure, Bell was never able to replicate the success he had in Pittsburgh. 
Dismal stints with teams like the New York Jets and Kansas City Chiefs left many wondering if he could ever return to being the dominant player he was with the Steelers. However, his recent appearance alongside Brown in Terrible Tailgate shows that, despite it all, Pittsburgh still holds a special place in his heart. What does the future hold for Bell? While he hasn't made any clear indications of a possible return to the team, his presence at events like Terrible Tailgate suggests he's open to reconnecting with the Steelers community. And for many fans, that's a good sign. Regardless, Bell's legacy as one of the best running backs in Steelers history is secure. The question now is, would he be ready to return in some capacity, either as a player or in another role, to help the team achieve new glory? The killer BS era was not only marked by incredible feats on the field, but also by a roller coaster of emotions and tensions behind the scenes. Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown, alongside Ben Roethlisberger, formed one of the most feared offensive units in the NFL, but the relationship between the three and the Steelers organization deteriorated over time. Le'Veon Bell was the first to show his discontent with the franchise, fighting for a contract that reflected his value as one of the league's best running backs. After failing to get the deal he wanted, Bell made the bold decision to sit out the 2018 season, which shook the team and fans alike. His departure left deep scars, especially on a team that relied heavily on his unique skills. Antonio Brown, on the other hand, had an even more dramatic outcome. His departure was accompanied by internal conflicts, public arguments, and a series of off-field incidents that culminated in his trade to the Oakland Raiders in 2019. The relationship between Brown and Roethlisberger, which once seemed unbreakable, quickly deteriorated, leading to an abrupt end to an era. These events have left many Steelers fans feeling betrayed, as they watched two of their greatest talents leave amid controversy. However, Bell and Brown's recent reunion at Terrible Tailgate could be the beginning of a rapprochement between them and the organization. Could time heal these wounds and bring a new beginning for these icons? Ben Roethlisberger, the third member of the iconic Killer BS trio, has kept a low profile since retiring at the end of the 2021 season. As the quarterback and leader of the team during this era, Big Ben was the driving force behind the Bell and Brown show. Together, they put up impressive numbers, but more than that, they left an everlasting mark on Steelers history. While Bell and Brown both left the franchise under tumultuous circumstances, Roethlisberger. The question arises, could Roethlisberger also join in this celebration of nostalgia? While it is highly unlikely that he will return to the field as a player, his presence at an event like the Terrible Tailgate or a game at Heinz Field could bring an emotional moment of reconciliation for fans. After all, Roethlisberger was the architect of the plays that turned Bell and Brown into superstars. And for Steelers fans, the idea of seeing the three of them together again, even if just on a stage or special event, would be the perfect closing of a cycle. It would be a tribute to that golden era that, despite its troubled end, brought so much joy and unforgettable memories to Pittsburgh. When the news that Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown had reunited at Terrible Tailgate reached the ears of Steelers fans, reactions were immediate and varied. On one side, there were those who were thrilled by the possibility of seeing their old heroes together again, reliving an era full of strong emotions and spectacular plays. On the other hand, some fans maintained a more skeptical stance, remembering how both players left the team in troubled situations. Steeler Nation is known for its passion and unwavering loyalty to the team, but also for being ruthless with those they feel have betrayed the team. When Bell and Brown left Pittsburgh, many fans felt a sense of abandonment, especially considering the high expectations that were placed on the trio of killer BS. However, time seems to have softened some of that hurt, and many are willing to forgive and celebrate the talent these players brought to the team. On social media, the hashtag hashtag Killer Beer Reunion has begun to gain traction, with fans calling for the Bell and Brown reunion to be held at Heinz Field. The desire for a full reunion, perhaps even with Ben Roethlisberger in attendance, is a living hope among many fans. The idea of celebrating these players, not for how they left, but for what they accomplished together, seems to be taking shape. The real test, however, will be Brown's return to Pittsburgh. If he does show up for the matchup against the New York Jets as promised, 
it will be a defining moment in how fans will receive him. With Bell in his corner, and perhaps Roethlisberger as well, it could be the killer BS chance to get the recognition and farewell they never got. Both Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown have had their ups and downs since leaving the Steelers. After leaving Pittsburgh, Bell struggled to find his groove with other teams, having disappointing seasons with the Jets and other teams. Brown, on the other hand, has faced issues on the field and a series of controversies off the field that have tarnished his reputation and complicated his NFL career. Now, with both men seemingly more mature and seeking reconciliation, the question arises, are they ready for a second chance? While a return to the Steelers as players is unlikely, there is always room for redemption, especially in a city that values loyalty and hard work as much as Pittsburgh. Fans may be willing to forgive, as long as there is a genuine desire to reconnect and honor the legacy left behind. Bell appears to be more focused on rebuilding his image, having taken part in several positive initiatives since leaving the NFL. Brown, despite his issues, still has a loyal fan base that would love to see him redeemed and perhaps involved in some role within the Steelers organization or even the city. The key question is whether both are ready to embrace this new chapter with humility and commitment. For now, the terrible tailgate reunion could be the first step. If Bell and Brown truly commit to putting the past behind them, the path to redemption is clear. And with Steeler Nation watching closely, it will be fascinating to see how this journey back into the hearts of fans unfolds. The possibility of a symbolic return of Bell and Brown even if only as public figures associated with the Steelers, has interesting implications for the current team. While the era of the killer BS is long gone, the impact these players had on the franchise's success still resonates, and their presence at events or in the team environment could serve as an inspiration to the next generation. The Steelers are in a transitional period, with a new quarterback and a group of young talent looking to establish themselves. The presence of icons like Bell and Brown could provide a direct connection to the franchise's rich history, reinforcing the values of excellence and dedication that have always defined the Steelers. In addition, these players know what it means to play in Pittsburgh and could go some way to instilling that winning mentality in the younger generation. However, there are risks involved. If their return is not carefully planned, it could reopen old wounds and divide the fan base. There are those who still harbor resentment over the way they both left the team, and bringing these players back into the spotlight could be a risky gamble. However, with time and the right narrative, Bell and Brown's impact on the Steelers' present and future could be extremely positive. In the end, what really matters is how this story is told and received. If Bell and Brown demonstrate a commitment to honoring the legacy of the franchise and reconnecting with Steeler Nation, the impact of this potential return could be profoundly transformative, not only for them, but for the current team as well.